Hey everybody, we are teaching Vermilion, and this time we're going to take a look at a new feature called the Vermilion Overlay, which allows you to put your easel and paints into other VR apps. So if you wanted to paint the landscape in Skyrim, or the city in Half-Life Alex, or any other VR app, we're going to use Google Earth as our example, as a way we can overlay VR onto other VR apps. Now the trick is, you start Vermilion first with the VR option. Then you can start up whatever VR app you want, and the easel will be there. You can even disable the easel temporarily to make sure you've got yourself in the right place in the app. Then activate the easel and you're off and painting. Make sure you're in a safe spot. But we'll take a look at that now and we'll fire up Google Earth. So hang on to your headsets, we're going to go to desktop view. So here we are in Steam. First, I'm going to fire up Vermilion to activate the overlay. Then I'm going to choose which app, in this case it'll be Google Earth, to set up where I want to go. So here we go, first with Vermilion, and now I choose the overlay version. If you always like the overlay, you can check that in, or if you just want to try it out, you don't have to. But now it's going to fire up Vermilion in the headset. So here in the headset, you can see I'm in the default Steam VR starting, but we've got our easel, we've got our palette. We can actually interact with our tools and things, grab brushes, that type of stuff. Let's see if I can get this back. There we go. And we can move the easel, so it is still fully interactable, but we don't have the environment. Now let's jump back to the desktop. Okay, so Steam is running as the overlay, and now we're going to fire up Google Earth and find a place we want to paint. Now, when you're in Vermilion Overlay, we will get these controls at our feet. The eyeball allows you to turn on and off the overlay so that we can bring up a nice place to paint. Uh, let's go to Australia. Beautiful Australia. Let's get to a nice position. Let's bring the sun to a nice time of day. Yeah. Now we will reactivate the overlay. Why did I get my controller to point at it? There we go. Now if I pull the trigger, I've got the Vermilion controls. And I can move and get to where I want to be. Now I can use Vermilion. We'll make a whole new painting. And off we go. So there you have it. We can bring the Vermilion painting equipment into other VR apps. So hopefully this gives you an idea of some places you want to play, things you want to try. We also are going to be linking in our card at the top. We've got a example of a video with a whole bunch of different VR games with our easel set up therein. So hopefully this gives you some new places to set up your easel. If you want to paint the Skyrim landscape or a X-Wing Star Wars Squadron's hangar, that type of thing, you can bring your Vermilion painting tools into other VR apps. Let us know in the comments below if you have questions. Let us know if you've got your own videos of uh, Vermilion paintings. We love showing off what people do. I hope this was helpful. Have fun, guys. We'll see you next time.